So the last few months at Team GAN have been pretty amazing. A couple of weeks ago, our entire dev team got together here in Baltimore to work on some new features that are gonna be really cool, but we can't exactly talk about them yet. Trust me on this, you're gonna love them. And in case you think all we did all week was slave away on lines of code. Oh, come on, do some tricks. Do so. Oh. <laughs> Yo, Jake, what happened there? <laughs> Nailed it. <laughs> One of the features that we can talk about is a new public calendar link. So now you can create a link in Team Gantt that you can share with people outside of your project that contains only the information that you want them to see. So keep an eye out for this new feature. In addition, we've also begun to move Team Gantt's core services over to AWS. We're hoping this brings performance increases across the app, especially for users outside of the US. While the team was here, we were able to get an interview from one of our developers, Brad Bumbelow. My name is Brad Bumbelow, and I'm a developer with Team Gantt, and I'm from the sunny coast of Florida. I have lots of kids, so uh, that definitely takes up a lot of uh, free time, but I enjoy um, coffee, roasting coffee, brewing coffee, uh, definitely drinking coffee. It's a, it's a great thing. If I have any time left over that, maybe reading some books or uh, catch up on some online uh, articles and things like that. I, I really like the small team structure. You know, it's really easy to get things worked on, get things done. If you want to work on something, something needs to be done, we can work on it. My favorite thing, I think, actually, is being able to work with people all over the world when I help out on some support tickets. And you'll talk to people from Australia or Germany or uh, you know Switzerland or France, and of course the United States. But it's really neat being able to talk to people all over the world who are using what you're working on every day and be able to help them out. I get to work on actually a lot of different stuff. I get to work on some of our backend API, um, of course the web, the web app that everyone uses, and then even some of the Trello integration. It's been a lot of fun working on that. There's some other features that are a little secret right now that probably my favorite, but <laughs> they'll be coming soon. In our last video update, we had just launched our checklist feature. In this update, we're proud to announce that Checklist has gotten even better. You can now edit Checklists and drag and drop to reorder them. So that's it for this update. Don't forget, you can leave us feedback at video at teamgant.com or leave a comment. Let us know what you think of Checklists. Has it been a useful feature to you? We hope so. We'll see you next time. So that's that. <sighs> <laughs> Don't put that in there. Now I know it's going in. Oh, yeah. Yeah. <laughs>